Hello everyone, my name is Gus. Hi, I'm Woody. And today we're gonna be reacting to a video that it's basically goes back to everyone that has told us to never react to a free diving video. Perfect. So we, so should we do got that. a free diving video today, uh, which is which is great. Now we're not experts on free diving, as we've already said. By the way, yesterday, this is off topic. I know this is making the intro longer, but I was watching that video Limitless from um, Chris Hemsworth. He was doing a, a four-day fast. That was the episode. And then he was doing some free diving. And he's like, well, let me introduce you to my coach. It was Tanya Streeter, oh, who was in our show. Great coach. Boy. Right? For for free diving. I'm like, you know, I, I, I feel bad for Tanya. You know, after experiencing the high of being on Dive Talk to go down to Disney Plus and being with Chris Hemsworth. <laughs> Must, I mean, it's, you know, career is... <laughs> going down the drain but you know it was entertaining anyway back to free diving. maybe tanya will have you back then <laughs> well to rescue her career yeah. all right uh so anyway let's talk about this guy this t video's title experience the world through the eyes of a free diver let's check it out okay it's already beautiful <laughs> just look at the quality i'm saying immediately You don't think this is gonna be giving people? Uh... Um, but my first, I already have a. Co wow, look at that! He, how, he used a giant rock. Rugby. Well, it took that long to be in awe. This guy yeah. is amazing. You can tell. Look at that efficiency. Just look at the streamlining of his body and the not waste of energy. Now, one thing I noticed, and this I'm gonna amazing. I'm gonna ask for comments below from our free diving community. Hit the weights that he's using are under his top, under his suit top. It's like a two-piece wetsuit that he has. You see, the weights are underneath it. Is that for streamlining? It seems like that's against the rules. I don't know. I'm not a free diver again. Are there rules for that? Standards that tell you you have to wear weights that you can ditch? It's funny how we have different reactions, right? You're concerned about the type of weights, and I'm more intrigued by that alien city. That's that was obviously a, built no. by... Look at that this beautiful is, explorer. What no, alien no, city? What are you Just wait. About? In all kidding aside, just wait. I want you to imagine you in that vastness right there. It's amazing. How would you, do you think if you pulled once, you would get that level of a glide? Dude, I don't go this fast on a DPV. He's flying. It's <laughs> unbelievable. Seriously. I mean, yes. we would, you cannot do what he's doing is what I'm saying. No. This is an unbelievable technique. This guy's legit. This is absolutely beautiful. Wow, his ability to clear is an instant, right? Because that when you're dropping, that's yeah. a big depth change right there with non-stopping. So you're he's just clearing on the way. Yeah, he's those not doing the yeah, those, those eustachian tubes are just wide open. When I try this, will you be able to film like this? Oh, I'm sure you'll look at the same. I'm more People worried about like, Was that Woody? Or? And your camera work. Will it be similar? <laughs> <laughs> Boom. This, I know, he's trying to like mimic mountain climbing underwater. And it does... Doesn't it seem like he's not underwater anymore? That's unbelievable water is so clear and for him he probably doesn't even feel like he's underwater anymore sure I'll go right through slide through that and hope it comes out somewhere overhead no problem look how calm he is and every movement is deliberate I just wonder if I did this oh I, I put that wetsuit on and I did this if people can tell the difference or if they will be like wait is that Gus I'm just 
That is so stunning. Dropping. Man, if you can't relax, I would love to just be like cuddled up, listening, watching this, and look at this. Oh man, that's ice. Now that was look. I'm gonna I'm gonna give them a big shout out to this detail that I think most people would miss. I have to go back and show you this. Look how he enters the ice in such a perfect vertical thing. Like how did he do that? Did he jump and go and go down? Just watch watch how he enters the ice. Perfectly vertical. He's. I wonder Absolute. if they had like a chair or something and no, he dove he, from no, it. He's just, he's truly an expert. Look at that. Look at the movements of his body, man. He's so efficient. Boom. There's the triangle that you cut open. Awesome. Look at that cut. Good job. Whoever edited this video. It's like awesome. he's he it's like he shot into a whole new environment. That yeah. is so creative. So this is Mexico. I think this is a hydrogen sulfite layer below. We've talked about those in the past. It's like decaying material basically and it's between salt water and fresh water. It gets stuck in the middle and it looks like a hazy lake like that. You know, you, you haven't done much of this, but when we're, when we're surface supply diving at the Georgia Aquarium, mm -hmm. you see that movement where you're kind of jumping and then gliding to the, to something else? That's why I love the surface supply. We'll jump from like one rock area over to another, and it's the only time we're going to feel like astronauts. Yeah. There's nothing on your back, and you just, there's no fins on you when you're surface supply diving. It's a great feeling. Wow. Ocean. Uh oh, that guys. No, I I don't oh, think that. The... I don't. That's that. We we saw that video. Remember yes. those guys that are amazing at hunting underwater? Yeah, those tribes and stuff. That tribes. That's who these guys are. And they're, by the way, they're just um. What's the word I'm trying to use? They've acclimated to be able to breath hold like. Yeah, acclimated. Yeah. So long. Look at this. With current lying through there. He's just, he's... He really has become one with the environment, this guy. That's something that I notice. And the marine life, I feel like, is comfortable with him because he's calm and they feel that oneness that he feels. That's, that's what I think that he's mastered. By the way, the answer is yes, those are sharks. In case you were watching, you're like, are those sharks? Yes, all of those are sharks. But look how he's just so fluid and that keeps the sharks really comfortable. Right, they're awesome. He's just calm and fluid. <laughs> no, no, no. I wish unbelievable I mean this is insane wow diving with mammals period it's unbelievable and be on a was it a school of whales is it a school if there are whales or is it something else? pod a pod of whales yes and I right. think I've only 
I've not done a, I've dove with a pod of dolphins before. Yeah. But never whales. Look at this. So is that a sleep behavior or a feeding behavior? I think they sleep like this. Yeah. Again, drop a comment below and let us know. We oh, they'll let us know. Oh, yes. Of course. Marine biologist. You you're a marine. You're a good guy. I've talked marine. How dare you? You did not get a PhD before you reacted to this video. Just a master's. Oh, wait, we stopped at math. You would know if you went beyond your master's in whale sleep. Look at this. Look at this. It's unbelievable. And I've always said, if you get to do a dive like this, you can retire. Like, that's it. You don't have to dive anymore. This is the peak. It's pretty spectacular. I'm just, I'm just in awe of how oh. he is so in tune. He's so, hang on, he's so in tune with everything that he's doing, like the way he's moving and observing. He's just conscious about every single movement. He really is, and it shows. That's why the marine life is so chilled. I would love to take a free diving class with him or just let me go one time with him. Mm -hmm. For the 30 seconds that we would be able to stay with him, it would be really <laughs> amazing what we would learn. Imagine he would be turned around and he'd be like, Where are these guys? I just We've did one that. stroke. <laughs> wow. Th this was one of the most beautiful ones that you've played, at least for me. Yeah, this was. Look how he enters back into the real world. That's like a transition from that world to welcome back to the real world. Yeah. So you guys don't even know. Right. Down there. You don't have any idea what world I came though. from. I want to go here. Whatever this is. If you've been there, comment below. Tell us what this is. One breath. In Europe. And to this free diver. Can you call me? I would love to spend 20 to 30 seconds with you doing this. <laughs> but then we'll we'll take him a regular scuba. I don't know if he... I just don't know if that's what he wants to do. Really? I think he loves that freedom. I do. With his ability to move and be one yeah. with that environment, I just don't think he has any desire to use, art of, to use life support gear. This looks like France. I'm... And I want to go. I'm just, I'm still. Is there any cool dives we can do in France? Yeah, let's just go. Yeah, France, sure. Just go, Something's go near. here. Yeah, this, isn't this the Eiffel awesome. Tower near that? I don't even know what to say. Well, we're ge we're pretty good with geography. I mean, I remember a little. You know, remember your ability to name cities in Missouri. That's. I mean, he didn't think Kansas. Let's was not. There. I don't want to remind you. Let's but anyway, that, I don't want to deviate because of how beautiful the. I want to end with. He is absolutely incredible. Free divers, yeah. if you want to shoot me and say you could, you would, you're better. I don't know. I don't care. Right. I'm in awe of him, and you're amazing, sir. Yeah, yeah, he was amazing, and we have reacted in the past to other amazing free divers, like our friend Igor. I don't know if you remember that he went diving under ice and had to bring an axe with him to cut a hole to get out. <laughs> <laughs> because that's how they do it in Russia. <laughs> but anyway, if you haven't seen Igor in action, I'm going to I'm going to leave it right here so you guys can check it out. But dude, let's go to France. Bye everybody. Eiffel Tower free diving. <laughs>